the word of God together. Jesus answered and said to him, that is the Nicodemus, most assuredly I say to you, unless one is born again, he cannot see the kingdom of God. And conversation is going on. Question and answer. And Jesus said, the wind blows where it wishes and you hear the sound of it but cannot tell where it comes from and where it goes. So is everyone who is born of the Spirit. So the wind blows. We know that the wind blows, but we don't know where it comes and where it goes. Likewise, the work of the Holy Spirit is like this. And uh, on the Pentecost day, we see that the wind blows, very strong wind. <laughs> so Holy Spirit work can be rough, sometimes soft, the wind sometimes it comes so soft like breeze. So whatever the spirit wishes, the spirit will do in our life. And Jesus said again, God is spirit, and those who worship him must worship in spirit and in truth. So if we speak with our mouth or our lip, then people will hear and think. But if we talk to them in our heart, then it will touch their heart. If we worship the Lord in spirit, um, God's spirit will be touched. That's what the Bible says. So today, if you don't have the Holy Spirit in you, please invite the Holy Spirit because without your consent, Holy Spirit will not occupy your heart. So it's your decision. Be born again in the spirit and worship the Lord in spirit. God bless you. Thank you for watching. Hope to see you very soon. Bye.